Hi guys, I was thinking about a problem that I would like to discuss in microeconomics and I decided to start at the beginning and then we can go further. So the first problem and the, this is the easiest problem that can be solved in microeconomics and in optimal choice problem. For example, we have a customer and he wants to buy clothes, clothing and he wants to buy food. And the price of clothing is it's going to be y is going to be x. The price of clothing is twenty, but the price of food is twenty or is ten, and his income is like two hundred. So now we would like to find the budget line and how much products he can buy if he wants to spend all his income buying just one product. He is going to be y. He is going to be X. So if that person buys all clothes, he can buy just 10 products of clothing. If he buys all food, he is going to buy 20. Now we can construct the budget line. And here everything what inside this triangle he can buy. Outside he cannot buy. He will not be able to buy. So if he wants to buy eight clothes he is going to buy also food for example he buys eight clothes it's going to be like um, 40 so he can buy four more uh, food if he wants to buy less he can buy less and he can buy more food but for example we have an example and his income he has found a good job his income became 260. Now we have another budget line because now he can buy more clothes and he can buy more food. And now if he buys just clothes he can buy 13 now. And same time he can buy 26 food. So in same time he can buy everything what is going to be in this triangle and in this triangle for oh, he is already another another triangle because his income is higher now we have another example for example he can say okay that was inflation and maybe it was a zero inflation or something else and our clothes became cheaper now it's going to be 10 so if it's going to be 10 he can buy if if the pro, if his income is now this one he can buy now 26 clothes and he can buy still 26 food so he can buy now more clothes and same time he can buy the same amount of food that's why i have just shown you how you have to construct the budget lines and the same slope because this is the slope if he buys this if he wants to say that this is my optimal choice this is his slope if his optimal choice this one this is his slope and I and and that is that's it what I want to tell you about but it's a it's just the beginning and why I said that I'm going to tell you about more difficult things but if you understand this thing, we can go further. Thank you for your attention and be with me, mail me and watch my videos. Goodbye.